Hey guys, it's Haley, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a crochet like week, like crochet like week in my life, I guess, kind of. Like, you guys are going to see me crocheting this next week. So it is currently Wednesday, February 17th, and by the time you guys actually see this video, um, you guys are going to see what I already made. I made two little um mallards and then i also finished this little kitten so that's everything i've crocheted so far today i do have a like four customs that i need to go ahead and finish up but if you guys are new here hi i'm Haley, and i do crochet and if you guys want to you guys can subscribe and I would really appreciate that. So I'm going to start working on these customs. I'm going to give you guys a little breakdown as to what is what. And yeah, I'm going to go probably sit in my bed because I was sitting at my desk the entire beginning of the day making that stuff. So I'm going to go and transition over to the bed and get a little bit more comfy. Okay, so before I get started on um, working on things, this is my webs basket that I have for like my custom orders. Let me show you guys what's in here. So... I have a large cow that I'm working up in there. It's in this really cute um, color combination. Then I have a mini purple cow that's in the works. And then I have two butterflies. I have a pink and red one. And just, you guys need to just envision it. That's the body. I have the antennas and then wings. So you guys just gotta envision that. And then I also have it in red. It's going to be the same exact one in red. So I have two cows, two butterflies, and that's all the customs I have at the moment that I'm working on. So I'm just going to be working on that. Hmm, what to do first? What to do? I don't know. I think I might just straight go for the cows. Maybe. <sighs> Probably. I'll just go for the cows. Why not? I love making cows. And believe it or not, cows are definitely my best seller on Etsy. So, I'm just going to jump into the cows. They're probably going to take me the longest, so just got to get to finishing them. So, you guys are probably going to see a time lapse of me finishing the cows and the butterflies. But, go right now. Get the cows done. And, yeah. Yeah. So here's my update. Here is the um, white and purple cow. And then I have the other cow still like in the works. Oh my god, I can, literally can't grab this for the life of me. But there's the body. And there's, oh my god. And there's the head. But the spot's on the other side. It's just hard to hold like that. But um, there's that. Now I'm going to go ahead and print out some stickers for my thermal label printer and I'm going to finish packaging up some um, orders I need to bring to the post office. So I'm going to go print some stickers now. Um, this? All right, there we go. Then I have to put in the custom size. Boom. And then I print one out just to make sure that everything is. Okay, looks good to me. 
So I'm gonna go and I print like 15 at a time just so that it can go faster. I like to do it myself rather than having like the self like holding thing just because I want to make sure they're straight and so I just I'll just sit here and just manually do it. And that's honestly what just works for me and I'm going to print out a bunch so that I don't have to print out, out some for a while okay I'll do one more round or maybe two more rounds honestly and then okay I'm gonna do one more round And now I have a, oh my god, now I have a bunch of stickers and this is what, hopefully that's in focus, but um, those are what my little stickers look like. And then I have pink stickers that are like my thank you sticker, but I've recently printed a lot of those, so I still have a lot of those in stock. And guys, I literally bought this roll when I first opened up my shop in July, and it is January, so, and there's still a good amount to go, so definitely worth the purchase. And then I turn them around and just stick them back in there. And real quick, since I'm here, these are how my pink ones look like. They're just um, little pink rectangles. Okay, so I'm just going to slightly move over here. I don't know, where's the beginning? Okay, so I have some orders here that I just need to add some of these stickers to. This in here is a lovely, my unicorn. So I'm just going to go and pop a sticker on just like that. And then add one. To this one over here this package over here is my two gummy bears and then this package in here is my blue um, bow turtle so just like that they all have little stickers now and now I'm just gonna go ahead and print the shipping labels and then I have to go and head over to the post office. Update, it is now Wednesday, January 18th. And last night on live, I finished assembling everything. Almost, almost everything is done now. Here's the pink butterfly, the red one, my mini white and purple cow, and then this larger cow. So I'm gonna go get on live now on go on um, TikTok live, and the goal is to finish the two cows, and then later tonight I'm gonna work on the butterfly wings, and I'm also gonna be working on some last minute things for my crochet kits that are hopefully gonna come out towards the end of January. So fingers crossed. But let's do that. So you guys are probably gonna see me just working on cows right now.
I've been so bad about filming, but also crocheting updates. Thursday the 18th and it is 10 51 p.m. and all I've done today was finish the cows so this is how the larger cow came out and then oh my god why his ears look so funky like that but um here's the first cow and then the second one and that's all I did today I finished filming a um, fin not filming, editing a YouTube video that's that's gonna go out tomorrow, which is Friday. And honestly, hopefully tomorrow I can just crochet a lot more. Because these last two days, I really haven't done much. So, I need to work on that more. Okay guys, it is Friday, January 19th. And as you guys see, there are the cows. They're back there. They're all finished. And the last custom I have are these two butterflies. The goal is to whip out all four wings now and sew them on so that they can be finished. And I could be done with custom orders. This week has been so slow. If you guys know, I'm in college, so school just started back up again. I've been waking up earlier. I've been so exhausted, and I haven't been crocheting as much. So hopefully after we finish these guys, hopefully over the weekend, I can start getting back on my normal grind. But for right now, we're going to work on the wings for these guys. After spending some time, I did um, two sets of like the top of each wing, so now I have to do four of the bottom wing, then sew those together, and then sew them onto the butterfly bodies. So time to work on the little parts of the wings. <laughs> It is Saturday, January 20th, and in last night's live, I went ahead and finished both of the butterflies, so I'm going to go ahead and package my custom orders now, and then in last night's live, I also oops, um, started this pink dino. I finished that this morning. I made a hot pink dino, and then I also made a red dino, but Sweet Snuggles has like some explaining to do explaining to do what did i just say but these are all with sweet snuggles like regular i use the same hook they're all literally three different sizes and like the size difference is like so noticeable like this guy came out so tiny and then this one came out literally huge and then this guy is in between I swear I had the same tension and everything, but now I'm going to pack some orders. So you guys are probably going to see me pack up my custom orders for the butterflies and then for a mini cow.
update. I have not crocheted anything else other than those dinos this morning. I am working on a pattern and I finally started actually crocheting it. And I don't like how it looks. So I'm still working on this pattern and editing it. And now I have to literally fog this whole entire thing because this is a lot of yarn. So I'm just going to keep working on that for the rest of the night. And then hopefully tomorrow I can get back on my crocheting grind. Yeah. Check in. It is Sunday, January 21st. And... It's around like 4.30 p.m. And this morning I strictly worked on um, revamping up my pattern. So I worked on that this morning and then I went on live. And I did this pink bee. This guy, I did a bunch of mushroom boys. So this aqua, royal blue, and purple. And then... I have this light blue one to do afterwards, but I don't know. I've I've been wanting to restock Mushroom Boys on my Etsy just because every time I put them, they always sell out really quickly, and I haven't had any in a while. And then I made dinos. I made mushrooms. I honestly might make more bees, honestly, but we'll see what else I end up doing. That's like a little sneak peek down there of what I'm working on. But that's what I'm working on. I also want to make like pink chickens. Like that's so cute. I've seen so many people talking about and doing pink chickens. And I think I might do a pink chicken for Valentine's. So I'm going to finish that mushroom boy and then maybe do a pink chicken and then maybe do a few more bees. But we'll see where we are later in the day tonight. You guys are going to be so proud. Last night I got in my crochet groove. After I started making these in my live, and then after my live, I continued on that same roll. And oh my god, there's like an eyelash in my eye. Oh my god. But anyway, you guys, literally gonna be so proud. Let me show you guys. Let me give you guys like a little, not like a haul, but like let me show you guys this little collection I whipped up last night. So last night, I was in the mood to make like round things. Like I wanted to make things that were quick and colorful and I ended up making literally everything is literally round. But that, like, it's okay though. So, aqua, mushroom boy, dark blue, mushroom boy, purple, mushroom boy, light blue, mushroom boy, then, after making those mushroom boys, I was like, okay, I need to spice it up a little bit and do something cute. And I remembered I saved this pattern. Oh my god, this hair. I remember um, I saved a pattern for this, and this can either be a duck or a mushroom. But since I made four mushrooms, I decided, had, I decided to go ahead and do the duck. It's a duck with a frog hat. Like, this is actually the cutest thing I've ever made. Obsessed. Obsessed with the frog hat. This is, like, my new favorite creation. Like, nothing can get cuter than this guy. This guy is freaking adorable. Okay, let me show you guys what else I made. So, I made a chick. After making the duck, I was like, let me make a chick. So I made this chick, and I was like, I feel like making another chick, but I don't want to make this a basic yellow chick. Because I already have, like, a jumbo chick that's yellow. I don't know if you guys can see it, like, back there. So then I was like, it's Valentine's. Let me get in the Valentine's spirit, and boom. Pink chick. Look at them. Pink chick. These two so cute then still in the valentine's you know spirit whatever made up pink bee it's like a double pink bee it's like this is sweet snuggle so it's a like hot pink and light pink and then boom some wings on the top pink bee me i thought i could win to some yarn chicken yesterday uh-uh i lost yarn chicken and I was making another red and white of like my regular size bees 
Guys, we lost a yard chicken. There's only like four more rounds left. And I lost a yarn chicken. I need to go to Joanne soon and restock in some colors with red being one of the main ones. I need to restock and I'm always having to restock white. Like last time I went to Joanne's, I bought two balls of white. No, I have like a fourth of a ball of white left. It's probably because I've been making a lot of cows, but guys... So today is, um, so this is everything I made last night. Today is Monday, January 22nd. And we're going to see, I started working on a blue chick this morning, like a, kind of like a pastel-y blue, pastel light blue chick. So then we're going to have three chicks, the yellow, the pink, and the blue. And then I honestly might make a few more of these guys because these guys are super cute. So just to see how these ones do and right now i'm just trying to work on things that are time efficient because for like the last two weeks i've been working on cows and like dinos and like stuff that aren't as time efficient so i guess working on something that was more time efficient like i was liking that last night so we're gonna continue that today in hopes we can get down a few more things i honestly might make some colored bees because i have a bunch of just like simple like yellow bees but i think i might do a few colored bees just to, like throw those this hair is literally bothering me i'm gonna freaking cut it off but um yeah so we'll see what we do today guys look at this hardcore crochet setup so we get the computer that has the patterns the box of polyfill stuffing the two cases of eyes the hooks the scissor Got a little bin of velvet yarn and then got this bigger bin of my Burnett blanket, the phone for the music, headphones to play the music. And we are just going to start crushing, guys. My room is so messy, but we're going to worry about that after we make some masterpieces, so... I just woke up and I literally look awful but I'm such a bad vlogger I keep forgetting to show you guys what I make like that day so everything I made yesterday which was Monday I finished um some turtle fins for a turtle then on my live I made a green gummy bear then I made like a coral one and then Yesterday, I made an aqua green bee. Then I made a blue, a double blue bee. And then over there, I made that blue chick. And that's the other thing I made yesterday. Today's goal is to probably make some more bees. Because right now, I really only have like a lot of yellow ones in stock. Um, but yeah, I don't know when I'm going to finish that turtle because whenever I use like this yarn, 
I like double up the strand so that it's a little bit thicker. But when I do that, it like hurts my hands. So I don't want to work on that too much because I don't want my hands to like hurt to where I can't really crochet anything else and be comfortable. So I think I honestly might make gummy bears in some more colors and then make some more beads. And then I'm going to remake my duck with the frog hat because he sold yesterday. So I'm going to do that. And then maybe I make another jumbo dino in a different color that's not like Valentine's. Yeah. Guys, it's Tuesday, Wednesday, January 24th. Last day of this week vlog. Yesterday, I was not productive. This is what I, I show you guys what I did yesterday. I did this dino body. I did this mushroom. And then I did some mushroom like hats. And that's all I did yesterday. But today, we're going to finish the mushrooms. And then I'll have five new pink mushrooms. And... Uh, Oh, actually, I also made a heart yesterday. I made a heart. And if you guys were, um, if you guys were in the live, you guys would know what is wrong with this guy. But I made this heart. I still need to add the mouth and do, like, the eye details. But I also made this yesterday. So I guess I was semi-productive yesterday. I didn't make as much as I was thinking. But today I'm going to finish those mushrooms and then I honestly might make more hearts. But we'll see. Today's the last day, though, so I gotta be productive. I also gotta go to the post office to drop off some orders. But other than that, we are going to make today productive. Today, I also placed a big yarn purchase at Joann's. Because you guys know I'm dropping my crochet kits. Hopefully, first week of February. So I had to buy all the colors. And it hurt the wallet. It really hurt. I gotta go pick it up later. I picked up a curbside pickup. Gotta pick that up later. But we're gonna make mushrooms. We're gonna finish the mushrooms. And then we'll see what else we do. I finished my last few crochet things of this video. Let me give you guys a little haul. So, Mushy 1. The same one. I made two of these ones. Then we have a Sparkle. Then a plain pink. And then I have like this multicolored one. But those were the last few items of this week's like crochet week, or life of a crocheter, week of a crocheter, whatever you want to call it. But that's the end of this video. And if you guys like this type of video and you guys want to see more videos like this, definitely comment down below. And I made quite a few things this week the beginning of this week was a lot slower but definitely towards the end of the week definitely picked up a lot on my crocheting but also just comment down below other types of videos you guys want to see me make and just comment down below any questions you guys might have any comments and just anything i had a lot of fun actually vlogging this last crochet week and hopefully fingers crossed i get accepted into a market february 7th and then we're going to have a market prep week of crochet. So if you guys like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you guys aren't subscribed already. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, everyone.